hello everyone welcome back once again to another video so this will be all about the channel less exclusives line i have three fragrances from this line i tried a couple of few more but um, these are the my most favorite one so without any further ado let's start the video so as i was saying i have three fragrances here one i also have one miniature that is 1957 I really like that one too, but uh, my top three uh, are number 18, Coromandel and Le Lion. So first I will put number 18 in the number three position. I'll discuss uh, about this one first. So number 18 is all about like uh, medicinal aldehyde, uh, people's, uh, everyone is saying that Amrits, Amrits seeds is there. So if you really want to know about this fragrance, you have to have an idea about the medicinal smell uh, well by profession i'm a pharmacist so in during studying pharmacy i was uh, working I, I had to work in the lab laboratory so there i i can easily recall that this i i have this kind of smell in the lab every day so i don't know how it comes uh, like I don't know from where it comes maybe it's a mixture of all kind of chemical ingredients and for uh, even there was a cosmetology lab in uh, also I could uh, smell this thing in that lab as well so everything is uh, like related like it has some medicinal notes maybe because of aldehydes uh, they're saying it has amber seeds inside so this is the bottle guys it's a 200 ml uh, bottle i got it in a very good price uh, from one of the uh, local seller here it's from perfume center but trust me i didn't have any idea before uh, that this this can smell like this because it was a uh, blind buy i was just getting a review from youtube that it smells kind of like egoist so I was prepared that yeah if it's like egoist i'm really uh, like i will be happy to buy this one out but um, this is uh, not like a different uh, way different but it is uh, uh, different in different uh, transitions than egoist at the top i can easily find out that it is totally medicinal it's kind of like a hospital kind of smell so first of all will you be happy buying this one out or will you be happy trying this one out for the five five minutes because it is it is not uh, likable to all like mass mass pleasing scent no it is not a mass pleasing scent it is uh, it was never a mass pleasing scent uh, let me try some uh, reviews in fragrantica about this one someone wrote that this is very unique i couldn't pers resist purchasing a big bottle but another thing she added that my husband thought it smelled like a cleaning product i think he is mistaken so that means what that means definitely for uh, not a fragrance enthusiast it will be a kind of like a medicinal product it is very obvious but for a fragrance enthusiast she will or he will not w just think about or taking the decision decision uh, with smelling it for the first five minutes only he will see it's the middle notes it's the dry down and everything and how long it does perform and how the transitions are going on so all these things are necessary because these are channels exclusive line you know that they are making it from very original ingredients natural ingredients so this is for the people who appreciate this art this perfumery art first of all if you're looking for compliment magnets if you're look, looking for uh, compliments everywhere and there whatever you uh, wear then these fragrances are not all of the fragrances are for you maybe one or two is uh, is kind of the like uh, compliment magnet but other than that these are all made with lots of love lots of art and you know mixtures of emotions and everything like these these perfumes can talk it's kind of like that so excuse me fragrance enthusiasts see this uh, fragrances in such a way that's why uh, i'm explaining all these things here because i'm i'm giving you a suggestion to buy this one but then you find it out that it's definitely not your type it's definitely not what you wanted so that would be a disappointment i don't want to do that i just want to say uh, that if you're really a fragrance enthusiast whatever you're doing to buy this one 
uh, first you sample it or you have please have that expectation low uh, that it can be any of its kind it can be different whatever th whatever you are thinking in your mind it uh, maybe it can be different from that but however these things are really good in terms of fragrance it's really good in terms of the transitions it's really good best quality ingredients are there i can easily you can easily find it out and for and the last thing i will say that it has the chanel dna that old chanel dna that ultimately you'll feel that yeah it's from chanel you know i know uh, that you can feel that if you are very connected to chanel uh, previous lines so uh, let me tell another review that the smell of doctor stools hospitals clinic pharmacy wonderful someone is appreciating that that fact that yeah this smells like doctor stools hospital clinic pharmacy and this is wonderful so you should know whether you are appreciating this kind of scent or not but for, from my perspective this is a beautiful blend because uh, i don't want to smell very generic i would wear something that is different that is different in in terms of not in terms of just sweetness or spicy not like that but in terms of quality in terms of mixture of different kind of ingredients in terms of different very soothing transitions if i consider all those things then number 18 is definitely one of the best so for your understanding the, this is all about the medicinal notes at the beginning and then after like uh, after maybe 3 or 4 hours it goes to the base notes uh, and it gives you a fruity uh, kind of uh, flowery smell that uh, that is very soft and it sets uh, very close to the skin it is not a loud fragrance that will project and every, uh, everyone will notice you it's not like that it is very subtle and also very enjoyable like you will feel that scent bubble around you you will definitely uh, if you like uh, such previous lines you will definitely appreciate this one because it is one of the best release i would say from channel so this is all about the channel number 18 and uh, now i will like to consider the second one is coromandel this one this one was a bit quite expensive one this one coromandel well this is a beautiful fragrance beautiful unisex fragrance and number 18 was also unisex as well so i forgot to mention uh, coromandel is very unisex anyone can wear it in girl boy don't, doesn't matter but coromandel starts uh, at the beginning i'll say let me just spray once yeah at the beginning it is a bit different than lilayon if you try lilayon then definitely you know you know how lilayon smells but uh, let me explain you coromandel is something you will just like have that vibe in you that wow like if you are a fragrance enthusiast definitely definitely you will appreciate this thing it's it's beautiful it's uh, i will say uh, nothing can compare to coromandel in the previous line it is it is totally it stands out it's different it is oh, the opening is too beautiful too attractive and definitely one can easily think about that spending 450 dollar take the money give me that perfume it is very different it is very posh very up class very elegant uh, like lot of lot of adjectives i can add to coromandel masterpiece sell it to chanel for bringing such a beautiful masterpiece and the ode perfume version is there this one the ode perfume version i'm really happy with buying this one this is so beautifully blended and uh, what i appreciate more is you know the the dry down the transitions are spectacular like dangerously good it is very good i would appreciate all of the transitions the middle notes the base notes all of the things of coromandel really 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 happy with coromandel whatever it is at the opening it has bitter orange neroli and citruses but 
it is so different like it has the ores patchulis as well and it 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 starts to coming off very very soon like when i spray it you will get a hints of patchouli at the at the beginning it is then drying down to patchouli rose jasmine in the middle notes and in the uh, base notes it has musk vanilla incense woodsy notes white chocolate very uh, like you can easily detect this one this one is very detectable and the benzoin all in all the like exclusive perfumes most of them are using benzoin or resins like thing because to make it last longer may to pump it up a little bit more i'll just uh, put some reviews here from fragrantic as well see the first review i'm uh, i'm seeing here is love at first smell you will you'll have to appreciate this one at the uh, at the top at the top when you spray it it's like it's really good really really good i tend to uh, like fragrance uh, like from the 70s 80s and that no longer exist or have been reformulated i was a channel store buying a blue as a gift and the sales person asked me if i needed anything for myself i told him i preferred niche perfumes and he asked if he could introduce me to some less exclusive city channel the first was coromandel and immediately remembered the best fragrance of 70s i remembered the original formula of pour monsieur by pierre cardin fantastic i bought a full bottle so as i was saying this is like believe me it is one of the best release from the channel house and it is very likable very wearable but mostly i would say wear it in the cold weather definitely and another review is like this is a gourmet sweetness coming from a white chocolate yeah it is there but at the base notes not at the top it's delicious blended with the bitter citrus top notes you will see a little bit of bitterness um bitterness sorry but believe me it will not last long you will have something smooth coming out very soon the woodsy benzoin base floral you have to be well educated to understand this fragrance true this is very well blended you have to have a very good nose to appreciate this one otherwise for the people uh, buying some designers sweet designers to attract people then those notes are not matured enough to appreciate such beauty so i would say coromandel is one of the best purchases for me as well and i really appreciate this one uh, but another thing you you can guess that if you are talking a lot about coromandel then what will you say about lelao yeah true lelao well i'm i'm going to the lena now okay coromandel is done the uh, it is a beauty i will not talk about much about the longevity and projection and everything because this things doesn't matter for this kind of fragrances this thing really doesn't matter because you are not uh, wearing it for to attract people you are not wearing it to uh, get compliments you are not a compliment seeker for if you are wearing these things so don't mind this is uh, how i believe anyways so the lela i have two lela this one is 23 and this one is from 2021 uh, see this is the 75 ml bottle but you can see the juice color difference yeah it is it is different because this is a reg, uh, new batch this is a older batch i used a little i had a decant i used th that a lot yeah i would say there is a little bit different in the batches but honestly lelan is something really like something something better than everything better than everything lelan is the lion of fragrances it's the king it's the king of fragrances i know it will be very heavy for some people i know this will be very masculine for some ladies but trust me at the dry down it brings some magic it is totally magical lelan is something anyone should appreciate if he or she has a good nose this is something masterfully done beautiful creation i don't know i really don't know what is going on in the middle uh, what was going on in the middle well uh, the perfumer was making le lounge but trust me it was a re recent release from the 
less exclusive line and he he sh he should have been doing a lot of exercises before bringing this one out it is wonderful it is mind blowing it is ambery it is heavy it is less sweet more passionately it is um let me explain to you uh, properly all right for many people uh, they are saying that it smells like shalima true shalima at the at the opening i can feel that shalima is there uh, it is uh, it is a little bit shalima at the opening but trust me it's just because of the bergamot notes in the top and lemon notes in the top and that's it that's all that's all but after like 14 to 15 minutes or maybe 20 minutes you will see that this is going to another this is going to have another transition and definitely different than shalima the labdanum the amber is way 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 beautiful way beautiful this is like i will say the transition from the bergamot or like fresh citrus then into amber it's something that you will appreciate or you'll cherish for your life out because uh, let me let me spray it here i had the coromandel in the other hand wow it's really good guys after getting into the transitions when the labdanum the amber coming out the madagascar vanilla the patchouli the sandalwood the musk everything is blended so well like the blend is so well whatever the whiffs you are getting is so attractive so comforting so emotional it is something like a lot of reviewers are there they're they're definitely uh, saying that this kind of scent is a masterpiece trust me lela is one of the best of the perfume industry that is that should be appreciated that should be appreciated in this era like 2020 era because no one is bringing such perfumes so often and the people who really like such uh, fragrances such private line fragrances special fragrances fragrances that will remind you the 1970s 80s 9 to early 2005 that thing we are missing that was a really a very good arena uh, of having something like special like uh, you know the rolls royce that uh, that old rolls royce models are really uh, like special if you see such thing in a in the road you will get a look like yeah oh my, oh my god how beautiful it was yeah, obviously we we appreciate the new things the new things are coming out we appreciate we appreciate the modernization everything is good but 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 the past days are better that's what i feel oh it's 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 awesome guys anyways um let me explain you some reviews from the fragrantica i can see someone is written as the i blind bought this bad boy because i love animalic sense and shalima reading this described as square de rose meets shalima it can be done too good to be true oh my god it is the same leather smoke i call peachy birch tar from coconut cigar find out cedar but it's now combined with shalima's amber and resins that it smells like uh, shalima no it's one eighth slice of shalima pie so i was saying that little bit of shalima nothing more nothing more at the beginning but it does smell familiar the channel dna they talk about this starts out quite masculine i say it, and dirty i like it but it doesn't suit me 43 year old female she was so however this warms right up and becomes one with skin i don't find the nuclear strength that others do i have a march 2020 bottle however three space is plenty this is a nuclear because it is very very powerful very very powerful i for me it's nuclear but it depends on the skin chemistry everyone is different every skin chemistry is different everyone fingerprint is different everyone's skin is different so you should try you should try before you're buying or ex expend uh, this is spending a lot of money here i have no place to wear it though haha <laughs> i will wear it it for me all right so thank you for the review i love chanel another review i'm reviewing i love garla i love shalimar when i first met this one is haven classic perfumery complex and rich Chanel is one of very few real historic and respected high quality perfume houses with a lot of resources and in-house accord creation so these things can only be done 
buy such fragrance houses because they have to have a very good uh, source of ingredients they have to very have to have a very good perfumer otherwise this is not possible to bring such a masterful creation it is not possible guys things are going on like okay mix this and that make it more sweet uh, release it uh, make hype to the marketing uh, sell it off earn money get the profit okay then it's done but for chanel exclusives they are not doing this for they are doing it for the people who appreciate things that are done beautifully that are done with the love with more with with an art and everything so i love the channel truly wish them the best in the future so i also do the same for the channel and another one is saying beautiful if you if you like signature fragrances that you make your own you can pull this one out of it is truly amazing not for the team time it i will not i would not blind buy this one due to the price and it's not for everyone i find it very different than any other scent with a bit of chanel class absolutely beautiful so this is this is true uh, everyone should appreciate this perfume who are having i'm just uh, making it out who are having a very good nose who appreciate the art of perfumery for those people this is this should be the best from the chanel house because oh wow it is now changing i can see the amber is coming out it's very good coromandel and another thing oh my god these two are really head to head like if i get uh, if i do 10 out of 10 for linear then 9.99 will be coromandel very good guys you should check this one out i really love the lelion this is my favorite from the not all of my favorites are here but this is uh, the 10 out of 10 from channel so that's it guys um, thank you for watching this video i i really pray that you will appreciate these explanations and uh, for the people who really wants to have only one channel less exclusive then i will suggest you buy lila or coromandel if you are a guy but if you are a female then i will not suggest you this too uh, if you are like uh, if you like something feminine then you can try the number 18 and also the 1957 i i didn't discuss it about here because um it is my top three from the line 1957 is more feminine to me but that is a powdery beautiful monster fragrance okay so if any female is watching this video definitely you should try the number 18 and 1957 you should get this to one out and then try to try it first then uh, let me know what you think about it so that's it folks uh, today i'm signing it off from the channel exclusive video ciao Thank you.